A new week between the Trenton Thunder and the New Hampshire Fisher Cats. It's Zach Logue gets the call for game one of the series. Dan, any thoughts? Hey, this guy has a four-pitch repertoire, it, right? And those are a you, lot man. of nice options to have. You can go hard Ooh, soft. You can go in and out. And anytime you have four pitches, if you can throw them for strikes, you have the big advantage. And a wild pitch here is this one's to the backstop. And that's going to move that runner into... Into the box now, go, Trey Ambergy. Yeah. And he's definitely the off right to field. a fast start in the right. early part of the season. Hey. Oh, wild pitch, but the catcher is able to knock it down. And no throw, in fact, as he'll just hang on. Stepping in, Eddie James. Four. Runner in scoring <laughs> position with Sugan. Eddie. First pitch of the at-bat. A bouncer to the left side. He's All got right, it. hang on, hang right on. Throw right right first right gets him, and the side is retired. So it's no runs, no base hits, no air. Ready to go for the last half of the well, inning. And next catch. to hit is the catcher, catcher. Eddie James. Eddie. Hey, we're still in the early hey. stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. It. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get it. Digging in, Eddie James. He's 0 the for 2 catcher. thus far in this one. First pitch on its way. Smoked on the ground left side. Base hit, and they're into the hit column. That a boy, way to swing the bat. Man, I watched Chipper Jones for years, one of the best switch hitters of all time, work on his craft under the tunnel. It's Number not five. easy Number to five. put the time in, Second but bottom base. line is, one Don't of the reasons the why they do it is the ability to work off. the whole field. Clearly, he's been putting in that work, and it paid off right there. Got him swinging on the fastball there. Santiago Espinal goes down for the second out here in the bottom half. Here's a look over first and a dive, but he's back in there. There you go, left fly. All right, come on now, one time, let it fly. From the belt, the pitch. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. So they do get their first hit, but their first run will have. Hey, have a look. Stepping now into the box, catcher. Eddie James. Eddie. He singled his last time hey. up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. Out. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. Line towards center field. Catch made out there in center field as the Pick runner the will tag right from here. second. On the bag, on the bag. So stepping in, Angel Aguilar. He'll be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home that tying run from first. And they'll play for the tie here as he puts this one down. And the throw is late at first, so they can't get anybody out. Ready for another chance, Eddie James. He's got a chance to end this one and send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. And he might have done it. Can they score that runner from first? Cleary is digging for home. The relay throw, and they're going to walk off as winners. They've taken it here in extra innings. Endings just don't get much better than this. Great job at the plate putting the ball in play, and then the runner at first does the rest. Stop at third? No way. Rounded third, flew home, and scored the game winner. My heart is still in my throat. Not a lot of fireworks, but that narrows the candidate list for our top player of the game, and the man you see here was a key contributor, so he takes it home in this one. It wasn't a huge offensive day for him. He only had one hit, but he definitely made it.